not that many stages on this rocket. I have activated the SAS things, that'll keep it more or less stable. And then we're going to activate the boosters. <laughs> thing recentered. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> it must be too top heavy or something like that. Just 
Good. We have success. Actually, this looks like... Well, maybe it's just taken a while, but... It looks like we might have reached a pretty good angle for our orbit. Drop the thrust a little bit more. Try to hold about steady. 245. console or capsule has a little bit itself so it, it like if you let go of the SAS it just starts I'm not touching anything right now it's just spinning around on its own and now it's time to re-enter the atmosphere I really hope we don't land <laughs> on top of that, but it doesn't have a parachute and we do, so we should, we should be okay. <laughs> Look at their faces in the bottom right, too. That's just fucking awesome. Bob and Bill are freaking out. Jeb, ever excited? casually land on top of it, and they're all happy now. Yay, we're not dead. <laughs> Isn't that special? And we will end the flight. Separation at stage zero, 38 seconds into the flight. That's when we got rid of all the uh, fuel bo boosters, and it looks like every single one of them <laughs> collided with the launch pad. I guess I should probably like take off at an angle to prevent that. Everything else looks like it went pretty well. I don't... I don't think my other... Like, the stage that I ejected with the... Before I ejected that last one. I don't think that ever hit the ground. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, thanks for watching. That was Kerbal Space Program, my first little dicking around session. I do plan on doing more of those just because the game is fun as hell to play.